get stuck in the bottle. You'd think a man like him would have a maid, you know, someone to look after the place while he's away, someone to look after his milk, or a gentleman, a gentleman's gentleman. <laughs> you don't think he has a gentleman's gentleman tucked away around here somewhere, do you? Hmm? <laughs> only you. You're the only gentleman's gentleman he's got. <laughs> <laughs> well, if I'm his gentleman's gentleman, I should have been looking after the place for him. <laughs> Oh, you've seen that before. That's a toasting fork. It's got a monkey's head. It's Portuguese. Everything in the house is. <laughs> Why is that? That's where he comes from. Does he? At least his grandmother on his father's side. That's where the family comes from. Well, well. <laughs> You're drinking black tea? about it? We're not in Poland. There's nothing the matter with it. it. Must be broken. It's been a year since I played it. <coughs> oh, I have got the most shocking blasted cold I've ever had in my entire life. Still, it's not much of a nuisance, really. <laughs> Don't wear me out. Why don't you pull yourself together? You'll be ready for the loony bed next week if you keep this up. Ten to one, he'll be hungry. Who? Mark, when he arrives, he can eat like a bullock, that bloke. Still, he won't find much here, will he? There isn't even a bit of lettuce. There's nothing in the kitchen. It's like the bloody workhouse here. He can eat like a bullock, that bloke. <laughs> I've seen him polish off an entire loaf of bread before I even get my chap off. In the old days, he wouldn't even leave a breadcrumb on the plate. Still, he may have changed. Things do change. But I'm the same. Did you know I had five solid square meals one day last week? <laughs> one at 10 o'clock, one at 2 o'clock, one at 6 o'clock, one at 11 o'clock, and one at 1 o'clock. Not bad going, eh? Mm -hmm. Work makes me hungry. I was working that day. <laughs> I'm always starving when I wake up. The daylight has a funny effect on me. As far as the night goes, that goes without saying. As far as I'm concerned, there's nothing to do at night except eat. Still, it keeps me fit, though especially when I'm at home. I have to run downstairs to put the kettle on, run upstairs to finish what I'm doing, run back downstairs to cut a sandwich or arrange a salad, run back upstairs to finish <laughs> what I'm doing, run downstairs to check on the sausages, if I'm having sausages, <laughs> run back upstairs to finish what I'm doing, run back downstairs to lay the table, run back upstairs and finish what I'm doing, and come back downstairs and set Yes! The Where did you get those shoes? What? Those shoes. How long have you had them? What's the matter with them? <laughs> Have you been wearing them all night? When was the last time you got any sleep? Sleep? Ha <laughs> ha! Don't make me laugh. All I do is sleep. Yeah. What about work? How's work? Paddington? It's a big railway station. An oven. It's an oven in there. Still, bad air is better than nowhere, I suppose. The night shift is best. The trains come in, I give a bloke a half a dollar, he does my job for me. I curl up in the corner and read the times tables. But they tell me I might make a first-class porter, but I've been told I have the makings of a number one porter. What are you doing with your hand? What are you talking about? What are you doing with your hand? <laughs> what do you think I'm doing, eh? What do you think? I don't know. I'll tell you, shall I? Nothing. <laughs> I'm not doing anything with it. It's not moving. I'm doing nothing with it. You're holding it. Paul up. What about it? It's not normal. Mm -hmm. Let's have a look at that hand. Let's have a look at it! You're a homicidal maniac. <gasps> Is that a fact? Look at that hand! Look at it! Look! Look at it! Look at it! You've got one line right across the middle, straight across the middle, horizontal. There's nothing else. What else have you got? You're a nut! Oh, yes? You couldn't find two men in a million with a hand like that. It sticks out a mile. A mile. That's what you are. That's exactly what you are. A homicidal maniac. <laughs>